Hi, I'm Bilkis Bahari and you are watching the interview of the day program. I'm here today with uh, Mr. Diane Stancer. He is the president of Kazakh Slovenian Business Club. Thank you very much for being with us today. You're welcome. So could you share with us about uh, your club? What, what are you doing? Well, the Kazakh Slovenian Business Club was established back in 2014. Today, we, are, uh, we have become more than just a bilateral business club between two countries. Uh, today, the business club is, uh, is uh, becoming an um, inter-regional initiative, which is uh, covering from, uh, which is from two main offices covering two, I would say, pretty big regions. One is from uh, fr uh, one is the central and southeastern Europe, from uh, being covered uh, from the main office in Ljubljana, and the other one is um, uh, the Central Asia being covered from uh, the office in in Astana. So, the main aim of the business club is still the the economic cooperation between the countries, between the the economies, but also, of course, uh, the cultural and the, the the political cooperation uh, as well as a as an result of this economic efforts let's say so your club is like a bridge between kazakhstan and slovenia sort of yes um, many people many many also officials here in kazakhstan uh, see the business club as the main bridge between between uh, the countries i I hope it is like like this. Um, I would say we we are putting a lot of effort um, to build this kind of bridge. First of all, of course, economically, because we know that the uh, nowadays economy is uh, you know a, an engine of the world. Um, and yes, I could say, yes, we are a sort of the bridge between the countries. What are the opportunities that you see in Kazakhstan? Well, Kazakhstan is a, is a great country. Kazakhstan is a country with a huge potential, with uh, um, being, uh, having a major role in, in, in a very important region. We know that uh, in the future Kazakhstan will have uh, the, the role of Kazakhstan will even increase with, uh, uh, let's say, with, uh, with the role of the Silkway. Uh, we all know that uh, the longer part of, uh, or let's say, the, 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 the um, transportation way will, of course, use the... Uh, one the, road. Yes, of course. Uh, we'll, we'll use the Kazakhstan and Kazakhstani roads and railways and uh, all the stuff. So I believe Kazakhstan has a very important role, uh, but the role of Kazakhstan is not as important as it will be in the future. Is this your first time in Astana? No, I'm coming to Astana for uh, four years. I have been here several times. so. I can even I can even speak a little bit uh, a little bit uh, Kazakh. So I maybe believe... maybe you can speak some of the Kazakh words. Which one? Any any anything that any words that you know. Ahmed. Oh. <laughs> so um, and if you ask, if you if you ask me in generally about Astana, I believe Astana is a is a great city with also a huge potential um, with. Uh, with a strong leadership, which I believe that uh, has also a great idea what to do in the future. And um, I would say within the growth of, um, of the economy and of uh, all the potentials which Kazakhstan has, Astana in the, in the future will play a significant role. Thank you very much for your time today. Thank you. You're welcome. So that's all the time that we have for today. Stay tuned for our next speaker.